What happens if you grow two Nepenthes plants in completely different conditions? I tested it and the results might surprise you. Today, you'll see how soil type, humidity, and even lighting can completely change. How these carnivorous plants grow. I'm testing two identical Nepenthes plants same species, same size but grown with different soils and humidity levels. My goal? To find out which conditions make them thrive, and which ones might hold them back. If you're into carnivorous plants or just curious about plant science, this this experiment is for you. Plant A was planted in Kanuma soil only, with coconut husk chips laid on top. It was kept in much higher humidity and managed with 1200 lux LED light. Plant B was planted in a mixture of Kanuma soil and coconut husk chips. With coconut husk chips laid on top, it was kept in sunlight by the window, and the humidity was maintained at this level. Two months later, the difference was clear. Plants in the high humidity environment had denser foliage and showed faster leaf growth. However, and this is the interesting part perhaps due to the low intensity of the LED light, the leaves of plant B were slightly curled. On the other hand, plants in the low humidity environment remained healthy but grew more slowly. So, what does this mean for growers? If you want faster growth, high humidity is your friend. However, if you are using low-intensity LED light, pay attention to the shape of the leaves, as low-intensity LED light can cause curling. Finding the perfect balance of humidity, light, and temperature is key. This experiment really shows how even small changes in environment can make a big difference for Nepenthes. Have you noticed similar results with your plants? Let me know in the comments, I'd love to hear your experiences. And if you found this experiment helpful, give this video a like and subscribe for more carnivorous plants care tips. Thank you for watching.